see Robbie Williams and Marco because they're just pure sex gods. <laughs> so you're not actually really interested in the football? Well, a little, but if, as long as they win. <laughs> they're doing really well though, aren't they? Yeah, 6-1. Hey, up the reds. <laughs> <laughs> so what actually attracts you about Robbie and Marco? Oh, they're just such, they're dead down to earth, they're absolutely gorgeous, and they're just lovely blokes, they're lovely people to meet, I like, met them a few a couple of times, and they're just absolutely lovely. Do you remember them for their take that days, or do you think they're actually doing really well for themselves now? Well, like, because I was a really big take that fan, I was really gutted when they did split up, but I love them, I love each of them separately, oh god, for their own, for their own separate ways, so it didn't, the fact that they all went in their separate ways and Mark and Robbie have just both done so well. Just really pleased, really pleased with both of them, proud that I am a fan. And you've actually talked to them today or got autographs? No, not today because they, they won't sign autographs over here, which would be good. Got some good photos though. So. Thank you. Right, next one, Mark. Okay. <laughs> so it's going to be all the same questions, so it's looking too uh, technical. Are you a real football fan and have you come to see your heroes down here? Both really, yeah. But I've mostly come to see Mark. You want to come to see Mark? Have yeah. You that? That's okay. He's just lovely. <laughs> He's just really nice and sexy legs. <laughs> How well do you think they're doing? They're doing really well at the moment. 6 1 at the moment. So, so do you think they'll go away holding the cup? Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and have you been fans for like years and years since they started? Yeah, since they started. But when they went their separate ways, I mean, I've always stood by them. I support Robbie, I support Mark and I also support Gary, so I support all three of them really, they're doing really well. What do you think of their new music? They've changed quite a lot, haven't they? Um, I think Mark's changed the most, but I like him now, for what he is now, yeah. Robbie's just the same, <laughs> and Gary's just the goodest songwriter ever, so... You think really good? What do you think about his latest single that went to number one? Gary's, yeah, brilliant. I think he needs to go more upbeat a bit more though, because like he's doing a load of ballads and like, I think he needs to do something more funkier, because otherwise he, I don't reckon, because he only stayed at number one for one week, if he's done something more upbeat I think it would stay number one for quite a while, so I think he needs to upbeat it a bit, so but he's good. Fabulous. Damon, I was hoping to see Keith from the Prodigy but he doesn't seem to be here, so I was a bit you know, upset about that, I'm not really a Take That fan, so... What attracts you about Keith and the Prodigy? Like, he's not the I don't know. I just, no, I just really want to meet him. I don't know why. I just think he's really weird. But we, I mean, we went over there to have a look if he was playing, but he's not here. So I came to see Damon. I knew like the rest of Blur wouldn't be here. So, but that's but what I really came to it, see. When it's Damon, Damon is Blur, really. I know. Yeah, but they say Blur, and they mean Damon. <laughs> <laughs> so you're not actually a Take That fan, so you're not too no. bothered about Mark and Robbie. Not really. I mean, it's good to see them because they're so famous and everything, you know, you've actually seen someone that famous, but otherwise, I'm not, you know, don't really got their posters or their music or anything like that. <laughs> you know. What do you think of them? Like, Ruby is such an exhibitionist. Do you like that? Do you think it's good? I think, I, I mean, I don't mind them as like, um, I don't, not to keen on their music, but um, I don't know. I, I haven't really in, like, taken an interest in I mean, I used to be a Take That fan for like the first year they were out, but then I sort of drifted off. <laughs> I didn't take that much notice after that. So, no, not really for Take That. I'm not really here for Robbie and Mark. Everyone else is, you know. I'm just here by myself, you know. <laughs> the only person who's not here for them, but I'm not really interested in them, sorry. That's great. So watch this, you know. <laughs> okay. What's your name? Lucy. Lucy. Yeah. Who have you come down to see? Mark and Robbie. Why are you such fans of these two guys? Well, I was, fan, I was a fan of Take That for ages, for like years, and I like Gary the best, but I like all of them, and they're like separate way. And they're just gorgeous, and they've got really nice personalities and everything. So do you think they've changed for the better, and it was a good thing for them to split up? No, I think they were better all together, but I mean, I still carry on supporting them, but I think, personally, they were better all as Take That. I think it was more like, more of a vibe. And what about Gary then? What do you think about him and his, his music? Single? I think he's doing really well for himself, I think really good what he's doing and everything sounds like really similar to take that and i like take that's music and everything what about mark though because he's changed quite significantly really didn't he yeah i do like it i didn't like it at first but his music's grown on me because i've got his album and it's grown on me his songs so I've, i quite like that album now and robbie's is good as well i love robbie's songs he doesn't you don't sort of think oh he's a bit over the top or anything like that you think well he is over the top, the top but that's sort of part of the thing that i like about him so just like the way he's sort of like shows off and everything I think he's it's quite funny he's cute
<laughs> so if you're the manager of their little uh, Lightning Seeds team now, what kind of uh, tactics would you give them? <laughs> Get your top off. <laughs> Forget the football. <laughs> oh, just need to see the blokes. Brilliant. That's all we needed. Thanks ever so much. Can you ask him a question? Uh, Please. Can I get right in front? I've just played you. And how did it go? We won. Did you? Yeah. Oh.